You guys can collect up anything you want. So. Hey, my guy's becoming rich. I can actually stand up. Cool. Very great. Oh, man. You're not folding yourself in half and falling into a tub for a long period of time. Pressure, temperature, boiling. pH balance. Those are your four basic ways that gold will drop out of solution in nature. Drills take a lot of air in case you've ever worked a pneumatic before. And if they were to run it just off of this, it wouldn't have enough air to support those lines, especially at a T-junction like this. So they create accumulators to store up tremendous amounts of air pressure. This line right here splits. This one actually runs all the way to the top of the mountain and goes all the way to the top to supply air to the pneumatics that they're working the stokes way up above, about 300 feet. <laughs> Beat up my air pipe, and then of course our wedge cut back there in the back blew out all that rock right there. They're gonna get in there and see what they can do. Bar it down. You bar it down. One guy's watching while the other one's barred. Whoever's barred, you have to be under a safe zone. So you're gonna get in there. See that? I barely touched it. That would have killed you if it landed on you. You're just gonna check the rock. Try to bar it down. See? That's down. That one's loose in there. That, that one's loose. loose. That should make this one. Oh yeah, that's a loose tooth. Oh, that one's loose. You see this stuff is loose too. Yeah, that'll let it drop if you cut out, huh? Very good. Then you will break it up with a sledgehammer and put it in our muck pile. Make sure you put it in. Yeah, make sure you, yes. Oh, the vein structure I'm interested in, right there. Yeah. The dark, deep red. Yeah. Instead of sitting like what you're doing, right? You need to be on your feet gotcha. because if things move, it's gonna pinch you in and break your legs. He's working in a coal mine. I mean, gold mine. All right, let's see what these guys are doing back here. Hand me that box of. There you go. Oh, you could have went deeper in than that. <laughs> Pocket that they missed. Yeah. Where's a good pocket at the end? Yeah. I got copper staining. And right there, see that? That is what I'm curious about. And I want to pull that out right there. I don't know if it's going to open up or pinch out. That's the thing about mining is these guys can pinch out anytime they want. For changes, you'll see sulfides in some of this mix, which is really good. You're going to have gold in that. That's not you. It's not good. Pull that off the side there for me. Pulling him. When you find targets, mentally note where they're at. Then you lay the tarp down and you go to town on it. And we're gonna watch the back of whoever's working. So if you're doing this and something over here is like starting to creep down and fall, I can just grab you and push you out of the way. I'm not gonna say nothing because you're not gonna have time to react. We're gonna we're gonna be focusing on pockets. We're gonna high grade. Look at that. Oh yeah. Yeah, I like it. Well, no, we don't have a second tarp. See that light green in there, right yeah. there. Keep an eye on that shaft. Just in case it decides to give you a surprise. Yeah, Daddy's got to go in his man cave for a minute. I'll be right back. <laughs> How come Daddy's so quiet? I work this all day long. Targets here. See the copper standing here. Yeah, we got some good targets out of here. Beautiful looking material. 
Oh, that's just juicy looking. Yeah. Give me some of that copper standard, boy. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing up there? Any bags? Not there. Where? There. We got one on. Good job. All right, you can get up. I got it. Right, you sure? Yeah, I got it. I don't know if I can get up. It's on me. <laughs> Dude, you ate your Wheaties today, huh? Hell yeah! <laughs> no worries. I think I'm going to forget my skills. 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 <laughs> we're going around and we found these timbers. So we're going to go ahead and, and try to support the back as we pull these columns. So I don't recommend it, so don't do that at home. We're going to shore all this up, pull this and that column out, see how much gold's in it. You'd be amazed what a man would do for gold or a woman. <laughs> That's right. Let me start mine. But I'm thinking that anything's better than nothing. I'm going to have a team in here, and you'll see the seam on the left-hand wall. You're going to be following that seam with the MD-20. Jeff, how many people are you putting in there with you? Uh, I think I'm going to put four in here. Okay. That's it. Get yeah. angle is tough. Oh, 20 years of service. So, would you really go to the VA to get help? No. No! <laughs> How come you're not standing straight up? What's the matter with you? <laughs> <laughs> Is it a tiny column you're working on right there? Well, you're just about through it. Yeah, see that? Yeah, but it's it's hard going, two, huh? Two feet deep, and I don't get a good swing. Yeah. On the muck. I don't envy them. I'll tear it up now. No, they were tough though. Tough boogers. You get a lot of work. A lot of work. I always wonder how they did it. Then you see people too lazy to get out of the car from Walmart, so they have them drive them up to the front. How do you feel about that one? Yeah. Yeah, up right forearm. Don't mind to make an old man out of you. Don't give up your J job. With the glue. <laughs> oh, give it a couple more times. <laughs> oh. Ah! Action here. Ah! 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 Yeah. Ah! Yeah, he's not stopping. Day and night, the man's tearing it apart. He's right on in. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. Just like Mama used to make. <laughs> Let me get in there and help him. Thank you, sir. Yep, may I have another? <laughs> oh, yeah, no, that's... Yeah, are you ready? Ah. Let's get somebody up at the top so we can grab, catch him. Without hitting my head. <laughs> Scenario we've been finding gold with the pyrite. Look at that. 
Mmm, sulfides. So what happens is, is the sulfides, when they oxidize, the sulfur goes away and it leaves iron and if there's any gold, gold. So you'll have iron, which is oxidized down into hematite and limonite and free mill gold. So basic chain mill, flail mill. Nothing special, we built this ourselves. Use eight chains. Uh, we got two strike plates we welded in here, beads in the back, a two horsepower motor. We got our screens up here on the side, crushes it, it hits the strike plate, breaks into little pieces. If it can't go through this little tiny screen, then it comes through and gets hit again. And the cycle repeats. All right, All right this is a flange bearing. In case you don't know what a flange bearing looks like. Flange block bearing. And anyway, this is going on to our, our chain mill and we just blew this bearing out, which means we can't crush any roll of rock. So we're gonna have to figure out what we're gonna do. And as a miner, you're gonna encounter things like this all the time. You're gonna have machines break, you're gonna have hardware failure. Anyway, so you're gonna have to work around, figure out a way to fix it, especially if you're in a field. You better get used to doing the MacGyver dance. Look oh at that. Oh my gosh. There it is. Come here. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh my Look gosh. at that. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? <laughs> Look at that. If that don't give you the fever, yeah. nothing will. Yeah. Look at that. You know you got gold when you can pan it with a tub. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is the waste. I gotta dump it into there. We're not quite full. You're gonna want more than one or two spent. At least it's gold. <laughs> yeah. Alright. I'm checking my tails, and every so often, what do I do? Take it out of this port right here, I'll put it in a gold pan, and I'll pan it out. Why? Because I gotta see if I've got any gold in there. If I do, I gotta increase the pitch of my table. So right now, I've got my gold line at the top, and you can manipulate it with this guy right here. You can bring the gold line down or up. You can manipulate it based on the type of material you're running, because sometimes you're gonna lose gold, so you need to you need to constantly stay on top of the pitch of this table. Gold, see it? Yep. And look at that fine gold. Oh, oh man, nice. I, I can see a constant line even with the first bucket. Look at I that. Think that was. Perfect. It's what the money is. Right here. Look at that. There you go. Right. Belly up to the bar, boys. Yeah. See it? Look at that. Yeah. Come on, man, get in there. Look at that.